The teacher can intervene using real-time assessment in powerful ways during synchronous teaching. Diving into Unit 3, we can look at Lesson 4, where currently we have a 67% average. Looking, for example, at the prime number check for understanding quiz, while the students are taking this, the teacher can get real-time data to help inform individual, group, and class level intervention using their Go Live dashboard. The Go Live dashboard shows individual tiles for each student, their overall performance, and how they're doing on individual questions. This allows the teacher to sort alphabetically or by average for quick, efficient individual intervention. The teacher can click on a specific student, get a report of how they happen to be doing, see the correct answer, and study student responses to diagnose misunderstandings and intervene with students before they get too far along and start replicating misunderstandings. The teacher can identify group level needs by looking at the question averages. For example, question two seems to be of a particular struggle. By clicking on it, the teacher can see the question and see which students said which answer to help to know who to pull and how to support based on their submission. These three submitted a blank, whereas these three have a misunderstanding, thinking this number 11 has four factors, helping the teacher to try and diagnose the misunderstanding for this group, pull them, and efficiently support them correcting the misunderstanding. The teacher can quickly move through the questions to do this for any question that students have submitted results for. Finally, the teacher can identify class level needs either by seeing class performance on a specific question suffer greatly or see the overall average or distribution of scores indicate that the teacher needs to pause and to intervene immediately with whole class instruction to correct misunderstandings. Additional helpful supports include being able to identify students who are performing well on specific questions and asking them to partner with those who happen to need help and other such types of interventions to be discussed in other screencasts, leveraging the real-time tool in powerful ways. Teachers can look at the tile view, or if they like, a spreadsheet view, and quickly look to see how students are doing, sort for intervention, either by student or by question, to efficiently intervene at the individual, group, and class levels.